Hello and welcome. This is Nolan Formulary with Nest, and I have Linda Shaw with me here today. Linda, thank you so much for coming on. Thank you Appreciate for having it. me. Of course, thank you. So, Linda, if you can uh, explain to us what is the Nest organization? Um, the Nest organization is a volunteer organization, people helping people within St. James. And what they do is we help them with tasks to help them live longer in St. James, and um, simple tasks like driving them to doctor's appointments and and, um, doing little household tasks and stuff like that so that they um, can just live there longer because a lot of people who've moved down here don't have family around. Which is super nice. Mm -hmm. Now I know, Linda, you are a, a village leader with Nest. Mm -hmm. um, so explain if you can what, what your role is and what is a village leader. Well, I started as a volunteer. Okay. And so um, eventually I moved up the role. So my role as a village leader is I... Um, and in charge of all of the volunteers. So I okay. bring on the volunteers, I help with the orientation, I organize it, and I make sure the volunteers who are the people who help the people who need the services um, are trained enough to do the services and are also um, able to uh, meet the services that the members need. So they go out there and if a member, a person who needs a service, such as a ride somewhere, I make sure that there's a matching that takes place. Okay, that makes sense. And I know I always get confused on this and we, we touch upon it everywhere. What is the difference between a volunteer and a member? Well, it's it's interesting because volunteers can be members as well. Skip okay. and I, my husband and I are both members and volunteers. A volunteer provides the services and a member is usually a person who receives the services. Okay, wonderful. And what do you enjoy the most about being a village leader? <clears throat> well, I enjoy helping people. And um, my experience is I'm a registered nurse. Okay. And um, I came from Connecticut and came down here and I was looking for a place to um, help people. I've always been a volunteer. My parents have been big into volunteering. Nice. And, um, when we found Nest, um, the first thing I looked at was making phone calls, and I was like, "Well, I could talk, you know, with somebody's ear <laughs> off." So me too. I, I could, um, you know, do that. And eventually, you know, my role changed along the way. But it's just so rewarding to help people in in little ways. And when you go to a, a member's house and help them with something, um, such as. Um, one of our Tech Connect volunteers yep. went over to someone's house and she just burst into tears. She had recently lost her husband and she was saying how lonely she was. And the communication between the volunteers and the members is amazing. Yes. And what they do is they come back and they tell us this poor woman was very lonely. So now we've arranged someone to make phone calls to her, which she appreciates nice. and find out what she needs. And it just gives her a level of comfort. No, I agree. It is very rewarding. Mm -hmm. I've worked with a few few folks too, and they're just so happy just that you're there, you know, interacting, company, yes. things like that. So, well, we listen, appreciate you coming on. Mm -hmm. um, if you want to become a, a village leader, a member, there's going to be on the next slide an email address and a phone number you can reach out to so please do so it's an absolutely amazing organization within St. James and so thank you for having or coming okay. rather and we'll see you soon okay thank, thank you, you.